What started as a fun adventure ended with a very grisly discovery. Some teens who were using a TikTok app that randomly generates a nearby location to explore got to the location. At first, they had no idea what was inside, which is why they could be heard joking around in the video. Cops got there, they confirmed the presence of human remains in the trash bag stuffed inside the suitcase. It was a suitcase? Why does this app always be taking us some dead end streets? Always, bro. It's right? Never yeah. Is that what it's taking me? No, it's a little. We gotta go a little bit further down. What is that though? Just, just a couch. Mm. I've eaten at this restaurant before. I never knew that there was a road behind it. It's just a dead end street. And it's taking us I do know. on that, bro. In the woods. Arrived at your destination. What? Oh, look. Dude. Whoa. There's like a dirt road. Is this someone's property, though? I don't want to. Oh, dude, this is sketch. Oh, this. <laughs> oh no, man. It kind of looks like the trail. Is We're like right on it. Up. Look yeah, around. yeah, let's do that. Let's do that. So one thing I've noticed with the whole randonautica is it, it might bring you to locations. Those locations, it's just it wants you to kind of like explore the general area. So I mean, even though it brought me to this location, there might be something really cool over there, something creepy over there. Who knows? That's what I love about this app is it gets you out exploring, has your eyes open, and that's what we're that's what we're doing right now. Have no idea. I've never even been back here before. Hey bro, did does it stop like right here? We're we're right over the spot. But it doesn't always have to be the exact location. Right, yeah. It could be like right around it. Somewhere around it. I don't really see anything. But I never knew this existed back here. Like does somebody live back there? I don't know what that, there's something like white in the woods over there. Let's go. I'm trying to figure out why there would be like a trail. Like what? Tire mark going that way? Yeah, exactly. Oh, wait a minute. Maybe it goes up here. Look. Yeah, it does. Why? I got attacked by a bug. Sorry. Oh, <laughs> it went. You know how some bugs would go like. He got me, man. I was like, what the freak? Sorry, man. Dude, his daughter went to a, a cemetery and there was balloons at the cemetery. Yeah. Like red balloons. Really? Yeah. Like it balloons? Something like that. Wow. Yeah. And it's crazy because she was imagining balloons too in, oh my God. in her yeah. thoughts. Oh, what's this, bro? Oh, this is garbage. I don't think there's anything here. Yeah, this might be a bust, man. Yeah. But it's still pretty cool. I mean, I don't think we would have ever found out about this. No. The app. That's one thing I really like about the app is it, it brings you to places in your hometown that you've never even knew existed, you know? That's, like, I never knew that there was a road behind this restaurant that I've gone to on many occasions. So, I don't know. On to the next. Now the fun part. Trying oh, to yeah. back it up, back that thing up. Camera looks a little foggy. It does. I do got that four wheel drive though, just in case. Yeah, yeah. let's worry about getting stuck, right? You know what though? Like my my kids are like so used to them now. Yeah. And you still want to look around at the same yeah. time. Oh yeah. Oh, I just hit a tree. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, Mr. Tree. It looked like that was gonna go somewhere too, but it, it yeah. didn't. Thinking that that was like a dumping ground, like somebody just came back here to dump like trees and things like that, I don't know. 
That's my guess. Or dump trash. The little baby wabbit. Oh, <laughs> he took off. There goes the couch. Somebody just dumped it here. I've found money in couches before. But mainly like just singles, maybe a couple quarters. Don't want to find anything else though. Imagine that, like a like a dirty balloon. <laughs> it's so crazy how every time I use this app at night or anybody uses it, it always takes you down these back dark roads. They're like back roads, yeah, just like mm, we're on another one right now. So creepy. And look at the tire marks there, bro. Oh, wow. It's like somebody was doing a burnout. Oh, yeah. Yeah, fun. So we're we got to go around the corner. Okay. Here. Hey, kitty, kitty. It's kind of cool. Is like you're you have your eyes out. You know, you're like really exploring. There's somebody out there. They're in a wheelchair. What the heck? Arrived. Hey, you okay, man? You doing all right? What? Are you okay? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, cool. You need anything? No, I'm just watching a, a movie that I have seen. Alright, man. I'll just check it up on you. Make make sure you're alright. Alright, take care. Just make sure you didn't need our help. That's the reason why we're supposed yeah. to be here, you know? Yeah, yeah, for sure, man. That's good of you. Yo, what is this place? It's a little unique today. What is it like scary? a is it like a home or something? I mean, this is the location it brought us to. Maybe it's back here. There's gotta be something out here, man. I felt like the pain was like right there where we were just at before we turned this way. What is this? It's another one of those roads. Oh, wow. Wait, what the heck? I've never been back here. Like, it's like a little hidden road, like in the woods. Someone's shoe. Hey, Roland. Yeah. You need some new speakers for your Corvette? Oh, yeah, I can always use some speakers, man. Here. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> Here, this will make your car go boom. Whoa, what is that? It's some some really nice, uh, what's it called? A kicker? Like old speaker. Some, some kickers, some 15s. Whoa, what the freak is that? I don't know. Hey, you guys smell that, dude? What? That's like, that's like the smell of death. Oh, like something dead? Yeah, something. There was some in here like vibrating or yeah. something. It could have been a rattlesnake, though. That's what I was thinking. Whoa, whoa. Oh. Or is it a bug? I think it's a bug. <laughs> I do smell it. Maybe it could be an animal? Yeah, I mean, there's definitely something here that's yeah. dead or smells like it's dead. Ugh. There is a lot of garbage, though. Yo, it looks like somebody's been living back here, bro. Is this an old tent? There's some, like, ladies' shoes here. Pants? Ugh. Oh, did you hear that? No. There's something over there, bro. 
What was it? I don't know. There was like somebody like walked like the stick was like broke. It's like somebody stepped on him or something. Maybe a like a, a big animal or something. Maybe. I think somebody's been no, living back here. The, the further you get back here. Yeah. What is Did it? you just see it? No. I do smell something dead though. Maybe it was like a living person going by on like a bike or something, but they moved well, fast. There's a bike trail right there. Okay, the there's a bike trail by there. Is there? A lot of bike tracks in the dirt. I don't know. I just want to make sure we're not on someone's property. I say we keep kind of looking around the area. I'm going to back up a little bit and just kind of scope it out. So there was a homeless guy out front because that building has been abandoned for a really long time. They're fixing yeah. it up. That's the only reason why the lights are on. Uh. Yo, wait a minute. Bro, look at this sign. Oh, no way. It says 666-6666. Right here in the area that it tagged us in. I mean, I don't know. I think that's kind of weird. That is freaking weird, man. Wow. Dude, that is crazy. <laughs> you see that? Yeah. 666. 666. It's a six. <laughs> right? <laughs> that's why, like, I, I tell people, too. Like, maybe people in the comments here, they can let us know if they've seen something. Like, because maybe they saw right. something, too. Yeah, yeah, that's true. You know? People have been hearing EVPs in, in the videos that too, we don't hear. That we don't hear, yeah. Absolutely. Let's go to the next yes. location though. Definitely. Yeah, I'm down. Alright, so we're back again using the Randonautic app. We kind of just like agreed right now off camera that we're we're gonna just maybe at the count of three we'll just say a word before I click or as it's maybe choosing a location. Actually, let's just say our intentions right now before I hit, like, go. Mm. Like, what would your intention be? Oh, I see something dark and good. Ooh, he, he's I wanna thinking. I find awesome. a missing yeah. person. Ooh, a missing person? Like some, somebody who's been missing a long time or something? Yeah, man, there's a lot of people missing in this area. Like, if you ever been to the Walmart before, they got all those signs up there. Like, yeah. Sort of, like, missing people. And they're locals. They're like people from Florida. Yeah. Tell me we're being followed already. I hope not. Oh, there's two cars. There's another one. Uh, we're, and we're down one of those, one of those roads. <laughs> but we just can't, like, kind of randomly came up here. What about you, though, bro? What do you want to find? Oh, man. I don't know. Now that you said missing person, I, I would say, like, a missing child. Like, a child that's been missing a long time or something. That or, or just something... Something really scary. I Something feel scary. Like we should pray now. <laughs> <laughs> Let's. All right. God, please keep us safe on this this adventure. Okay. We like scary, but you know we don't want to die. We don't want anyone else to die. No, 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 no. Wait. No death, no hurt. But we want to get scared. Amen. Yeah. A little thrill. Yeah. Exactly. <laughs> little thrill. Right little thrill. Okay, That's living on the edge, huh? <laughs> all right. Let's pick. Um, what should I do? Anomaly, attractor, or void? Anomaly. Yeah. Anomaly? anomaly. Yeah. Okay, let's do anomaly. Mm -hmm. Have you ever done the temporal phone thing? It's really weird. Like when you click on this, like it does. All right, so we're all gonna. This, this is really weird. Watch this. Generating entropy. Like see, it's like moving like that. Like that's some some weird stuff. Oh, it picked our location. Focus on your intent. Something scary, but not not death related person okay got us a location all right let's go to maps my phone's about to die too six minutes we look so suspicious right now yeah especially this guy this guy definitely like you look suspicious bro yeah got the new york shirt on oh you think i'm a gangster whenever he wants it to come out it will come out like his jersey accent oh yeah like hey you Hey you, how you doing? Hey, we're gonna go find something, you know? You never know what it's gonna be. It could be one of those uh, whack jobs out there, who knows? Yeah, yeah. <gasps> Bro! Alright, look. We didn't even realize it. Look look what we were right in front of. Oh my gosh, seriously. It's like the path goes right through here. I mean, this is not our location, yeah. but it just randomly it's goes through here. It's right by this funeral home. Sure. Yeah. yeah. Cremation services. Hey, have you ever done like a spirit box session in front of a funeral home? 
No, that's a good no. idea, though. Yeah? Yeah. I'm you got a spirit box? I do. You got your spirit got, box on? I got a spirit Whoa. box. I got the Necro with the loudspeaker. You tell me what you want to do. You want, you want to do like a quick one? Let's do it. Yeah, all right. Well, let me, uh, hopefully we'll just on our way. If yeah. I can tell you exactly where the crematory is, and maybe we can get as close as we, we can to it. To the crematory? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, this is an active funeral home. Funeral homes, they say, like every single one is haunted. If we can go in that spot right there, Ooh. bro, there's a camera right under there too. Yeah, flower deliveries. And that's. The I'm sorry, bro. Maybe like right here. Yeah, you, you want to do it in the car? Yeah, we'll do it from the car. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah that's cool. I would bust out my my phone, but my my phone's like getting ready to die. I have it on a charger. Well, Roland and I were out earlier on on yeah. jet skis, and yeah. I dropped my phone in the water, and I went to go. I'm sure it's yeah. happened to some of you. You go plug it up, yeah. and it says their water's been detected and stuff. Yeah, but people don't realize you can you can charge it still if you have a wireless charger. Yeah, so got the wireless charger there. My boy Roland hooked me up with the cord to to, to match it. Yeah, see right there. Bam. <laughs> you ever notice that wireless chargers are slow though? Yeah, they are. Like they charge kind of slow. Yeah, they, they do. I didn't know this about Jody until today, mm. but he used to work in a crematory, and he crema he cremated 172 bodies. Yes, sir. Yeah. 172. Uh, I mean, am I okay to share that? Absolutely, man. Okay, cool. Yeah. Well, sure. And doing the paranormal thing, man, I've experienced so many things from doing that. It's it's pretty bone chilling. Wow. Oh, gosh. I don't know how you could do a job like that. I, I, I just, I would just, I don't think I can sleep at night. Yeah. You know? Well, you know, man, I, I have yeah. such a respect for the dead and uh, yeah. I love That's the paranormal. Same. And I, I think that kind of made it a little bit easier for me. I've been doing this for so yeah. long now that I just, I felt like there was something to learn from it. And in all honesty, mm. I mean, I heard voices and I seen things in that crematory yeah. that can't be explained. Wow. Do you believe that the funeral home you worked at was haunted? Oh, absolutely. Yeah. I mean, I was only there for three years and did 172 cremations, but meanwhile, that place sat there for probably like 60, 70 years. Wow. wow. So, so think about it, like all the... Yeah. You know, the yeah. majority of the places we do, maybe three or four people died at and they're haunted. So, I mean, you can just imagine, you know, like if you were actually allowed to do an investigation inside this funeral home mm -hmm. right here, It'd be super active. Yeah. <laughs> That's why it's a great idea to do a quick oh, yeah. ghost. And here we go, man. Yeah. We're about to turn up a notch. Oh, what is that? What you got there? It's a Necro and I got my Honeytone amp. It's oh, okay. Nice. It's like a loudspeaker. Get ready. All right. I'm ready. <laughs> is there any spirits here from the crematory? Hello. Can you tell us what your name is if you're here with us right now? Will? Maybe. Or Bill. Whoa. Dude. We're doing an app right now that's called Randonautica and it's leading us to all kinds of crazy places. Can you tell us, are we going to find anything tonight? What? Watch yourself or something? Dude, I think it did say that. Somebody creeping up. We have to keep it. Just keep our eyes open for right. cars. Are there spirits that are hanging out around this crematory? Hi. Help. There's so much coming through, too. Yeah, well, how many people are being cremated here? Oh, yeah. Is there anything that we can do for you while we are here?
lot of spirits asking for help. I think so many spirits on the other side, man, they're just confused. So they don't know what to really make of this. But yeah. if you can hear yourself right now, is there anything you would like us or anybody out there listening to know about you? All right, there was so much activity coming through. I, I think one day we should maybe call this funeral home and be like, you know, hey, like, would it be cool if we come and Absolutely, investigate? Absolutely, man. Well, you know, with, with respect, of course, yeah, you know. Yeah, and definitely. Even c maybe come back out, like, at nighttime. Yeah. You know? Maybe we could say, hey, can we just rent out the crematory for an hour to do some EVP work, you know? Yeah, we could rent it out. And maybe even, um, yeah. Throw them a little bit. Figure it out. Yeah. Pay them a couple bucks, you know. Now, when you do the cremations, do you know, like, what, what the cause of death was or anything? Oh, yeah. Yeah, usually um, always, you, 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 every time you have paperwork up front and, uh, you have to go over Turn things right. because, you know, there's certain precautions that need to take place if somebody has, like, a, um, certain heart contraptions or certain things in their body. Yeah. What was the one death that legit, like, you were just kind of, you couldn't stop thinking about? I'll never forget it. Um, I was working one day by myself. I couldn't get anybody to come in and help me, and I had to cream, uh, cremate a 400-pound woman. And it... It was really bad. I had trouble. She almost slipped off uh, the table a few times before going in. Yeah. And uh, it was very troublesome, man. And um, afterwards, I heard a woman's voice speak several, several times. And I felt like she was just devastated about seeing her body, you know, disappearing like that. Oh, man. Yeah. Kind of still, it hurts my heart, bro, to think about it. And you actually heard her voice? I believe it was her voice. I mean, it would make sense because it sounded very panicky yeah. and uh, frantic. And yeah. At the stop sign, turn right. So we're not that far. We're like five minutes away. But, I mean, it was like on the same path as, like, on the street that we had to go through was that funeral home. That's one thing about this app, too. It will it will take you, like, into, like, the middle of the neighborhood. The destination is on your right. Arrived. This is someone's house. Oh, wow. Yeah, we can't. Dude, hold on. There's something here. All right, look. See, they have like Christmas lights up. Right. What the freak? That's one thing. I don't know why, but I've always been. I've been seeing Christmas lights. I even saw a whole house decorated for Christmas. Oh. I, there's some connection with that. I don't know. I don't know what it is. I don't know. Maybe somebody in the comments could tell us. Maybe there's something in that dumpster right there. A bunch of threes on it. <laughs> Well, yo, that's crazy. That's yeah. another crazy thing, bro. A bunch of threes. Yeah, because the three... Oh. Wait a minute. The threes are like half of the sixes. Yeah, the threes <laughs> are half of the sixes, but they also represent the mocking of the Trinity, which is the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit. Uh -huh. So, Whoa. I mean, are we truly being led somewhere tonight? Yeah. The signs? Wow. Yo, there's like a person in... Look, it's like a little mannequin. See that? Yeah. And it's holding something. Dude, this is crazy. All... Okay, so seven threes, seven sixes. Uh huh. Oh, okay. I just want to say, like, let's keep our eyes open to make a connection with these numbers. It might not mean anything, you know, but it's it's good to have your your mind open. I, I think that's what Randonautica is all about: is expanding your horizon and yeah. kind of observing things a little bit more than you usually would. True. Opening your mind learning this as we go. <laughs> this is my first adventure. What up? How you doing? Good. We're rando nodding. You guys never done it? It's like Pokemon Go on steroids. Pretty good. <laughs> you guys have a good night. What did they say? They're, they're drunk. <laughs> they're drunk. Okay. I thought they were like, maybe talking to do this at first like okay they're still yelling we're just randonauting we're not just like being weird sure this this is in the middle of nowhere in 800 feet the destination is on your right yo what the hell oh my god it's like a one-way road did you just get some plants in the car? <laughs> you definitely made her walk there. <laughs> Yo, we gotta go up in there, bro. No, -uh. is that where it's at? That's where it's showing. Wow. Yep. Oh, 
it's like another dirt road. It's up all these roads lately. Well, my truck won't even go oh, back there. It's a four wheel drive, or it is, but wow. it's it's still it's it's a very narrow walkway. Yeah, it is. You know this randonautica thing? It sent me into the woods last time too, just like this. Always sending us into woods or by woods. Yeah. Two dirt roads. Yo. There's something new. There's footprints. There's footprints. Look. No, they're not really. They're shoes. Shoes. Hello? You guys heard that? Yeah. I thought it, it was talking or something. You don't think we're on private property, you think? I don't think so. If you're using this app, be careful that you don't go on private property. There's something up there. Look, over there. No. There's a bunch of garbage here. Look. Wait, what? Is that a bra over there? It looks like a sports bra. Yeah. It's, uh, Some front. I mean, it's just somebody dumping trash, maybe. Yeah. It's a pool noodle. Some shoes. Hello? Over there. I didn't catch it. There's nothing more creepy than being in the woods at night time. Keep going right. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I don't know, I just say we keep looking around. I'm like terrified like getting attacked by a wild boar or something. Make sure to keep your Yo. Heard some kind of like, like, a grunt, like root, it was a grunt, yeah. Root, root. It'd be crazy yeah. if we end up finding like Bigfoot or something. <laughs> I believe that would be a, a first for Randonautica. I do see quite a bit of footprints though. Yeah, that's what's worrying me right now. Like, is it actually shoes or is it animals? No, they're shoes. shoes. Yeah. And Hey, look at this. Yeah. I don't think you want to walk the box out here anyway. You don't need like shoes. 